So, uh, hey guys, insert obligatory love of the show message here. Um, who was this? Tyler. Yeah. Wait, yeah. It, oh, sh- uh, yeah, it's Tyler. What's uh, funny is I saw that email, on the page. Email. I thought you wrote that oh. to like put a fake message. No, in he wrote that <laughs> in the email. Yeah, uh, he enjoys our Breath of the Wild. I do wonder what does the future of Zelda hold with Switch, though. So his question. Do you think Nintendo will alternate between 2D and 3D games, focus on reusing Breath of the Wild assets to make a sequel faster, like Ocarina of Time to Majora's Mask, or put a majority of the Zelda team on a 2D game and get this out quickly before shifting back to the next 3D iteration? Jose, do you remember a couple months ago, a couple weeks ago, I was on the show. And From I Tyler said, Sullivan. Thanks, Tyler. Hey, Tyler. I said I would really like um, Breath of the Wild to have like what the original Zelda had, which was the second quest. Um, I no longer want that. <laughs> This game is far too big on its own. <laughs> no more quests, please. I'm good. This is going to be enough for the rest of my life. Uh, there's also DLC coming. Yeah, there's uh, a hard sto- mode. Yeah, there's a hard mode. There's story sure. DLC coming. I imagine they'll add a new area of some kind. Yeah. Uh, this is one of the biggest games I've ever played. I can't yeah. remember. I m- imagine how long it would take to walk across this world. So that said, I'd like a smaller, more personal 2D experience. I like Tyler's idea of sort of alternating between 3D and 2D. I do think it'll be a very long time after the DLC for this game yeah. that we yeah. see another 3D Zelda like this. I um, They take a while, you know? So let's go with a, like a nice... Let's, let's get a Link Between Worlds 2 type of situation. Yeah, no, you know? It already yeah. is a sequel. It'll be three. Sorry. I'm, just, <laughs> I'm sorry. I can see... Um, Do you feel like, that? Yeah. <laughs> I don't see them reusing assets like the Majora's Mask kind of deal, but if you've seen like Wind Waker when uh, Phantom Hourglass, Spirit Tracks, they kept that kind of aesthetic. So I wouldn't mind seeing a 3DS game that kind of kept some of the aesthetic, but didn't like go for the crazy visuals, but like that art style, maybe maybe trying to do something with that, or at least like the, how the sprites look. Um, That'd be kind of cool to see like a separate kind of story. Why a 3DS game? Um, We see some love too. Yeah, it does need love, but that Switch looks so good. It does. That screen, man. I was playing my 3DS the other day. I love that system. Always have, always will. That Switch screen is something else. Like it's 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 hard to go back. I will. It's like a bite-sized adventure. Yeah. Yeah. Um, As long as they port it to Switch too, I don't care what the 3DS. There you go. (laughs) I want the 2D prototype of Breath of the Wild. I want them to release that as a game. I know I said it earlier. It it was so cool, and clearly they put a lot of effort into making it. Yeah. I think fans would go insane over it. What if it's starring Biker Link? Fine with me. And make it star all of the that links. They showed Biker Link. They show, showed Metroid Link. They showed all these cool concepts at the panel. Uh, you should check out IGN.com for the coverage of it. Yeah, uh, But great. yeah, I would love that to be a thing, like an mm. actual thing you could buy. Mm. Um, okay. But yeah. Um, I'm torn uh, for several reasons. One, uh, I first of all, console Zelda takes a while to make. This one took, <laughs> I think, five or six years. Yeah. Uh, it took longer than they intended, and uh, that seems to always be the case with console Zelda. Um, on top of that, I think we have the issue, uh, the, and this isn't an issue, but this is a reality. I think the fan service, uh, the franchise care for Zelda is getting out of control, I feel. Now, that might be blasphemy to big time Zelda fans, but let me explain. Uh, we've had A Link Between Worlds, we've had Triforce Heroes, we've had Hyrule Warriors, we've had Hyrule Warriors again on 3DS, and now we have Breath of the Wild. I just feel like we've had a lot of Zelda. Um, in uh, what feels like enough time, but I feel like Breath of the Wild is the combination of, you know, this new step, this new direction. I like that the DLZ exists. I wasn't opposed to it when they announced it. My only issue was you guys are being incredibly vague about what this is um, and that for a game that we haven't played yet. So now when we think, oh, there's going to be a new hard mode, I think we all at this table agree and have a better understanding that this game is hard. Yeah. I don't want to know what hard mode <laughs> yeah. is. If Link is like starving to death or something like like whatever yeah. you're going to add to that and, and make that unique and interesting, I'm, I'm interested in. Um, and years ago when Breath of the Wild was sort of just revealed and didn't have a name, I wanted them to just find ways to reuse this world. And I think the DLC is that. Yeah. Um, I think personally, yeah, you can work on a 2D Zelda or you can work on something 2D, 3D, hybrid, 2.5D, whatever you want to call it. But I do think that Zelda needs some time off. I think that we are hitting the point where you have experimented a lot with this series, where you have done a lot of cool, quirky things with it. I think if anything, I wouldn't balk at more DD- DLC when you're done. But let's l- talk to me when you're done in, in, the, in the holidays. Yeah. I obviously yeah. can't make that determination now. 
But I, I think Zelda needs some time off. Well, I got to be honest. I have good news for you because I have a feeling we won't see another 3D console Zelda game until like 2022, 2023. Yeah. yeah Switch version sure. 3 point whatever. Yeah. yeah. It's going to be a long, long time. I mean, it's how long has it been since Scoured Sword, right? Uh, so yeah, that was, was 2011 to now. Yeah. yeah. So, and yeah. then Twilight Princess was. 06. Well, we had it. And that's the other thing I left off yeah. my list. We had Twilight Princess HD. We had Wind Waker yeah. HD. Yeah. Presumably, yeah. we're getting Skyward Sword HD. I mean, yeah. I don't think that goes away. It just depends on whether or not they're willing to commit to reworking that game and I think yeah. maybe they will but here's the other thing I think after Breath of the Wild can you go back can you go back to the I way Zelda know. used to I be don't, I don't like know. I think you'd be sending Skyward Sword to its death if you put it out well, especially if you released it in the next year like yeah that yeah. shouldn't be a thing that releases anytime soon. I think that we've seen a lot of Zelda in a compressed amount of time well, I think it's yeah. time for some time off yeah well, it's also even be, from the HD remakes let's though. be honest I mean I feel like we saw Twilight Princess uh, and Wind Waker on the on the Wii U. Uh, in I also lieu- left off Majora's Mask. Sorry, yeah. and Majora's. I mean, in lieu of having an actual full fledged brand new 3D Zelda game, um, those were great. They were great stop gaps to hold mm-hmm. us over until Breath of the Wild. But we have Breath of the Wild now. Yeah. Um, porting Skyward Sword in HD and fixing some weird things in it, that'd be okay with me. Yeah. But I, I think I would just buy it and maybe play it for an hour or two and then go back to Breath of the Wild. Or maybe do something like, I like that uh, with uh, Red, the original Red Dead Redemption, Rockstar made uh, a DLC version. Now, granted, I don't want them to take this 100%. They had a, uh, a zombies type Undead campaign, Nightmare. Undead Nightmare, and then they sold it standalone. I don't think that would be a terrible thing. I agree. Um, I, I don't think that... Uh, f- sort of making something smaller and then finding a way to sell it uh, a, a, a separate way would hurt them. Yeah. Um, Especially with how big this world is. Yeah, I guess smaller. Yeah, smaller I guess the only world. challenge though would be like, what would the rest of the world do? And I can't remember how yeah. Undead Nightmare de- yeah, dealt I don't with that. Uh, yeah, I don't remember offhand. It's been years. Uh, but personally, I want Zelda to take a break. I said it, uh, marked the time, and I'm sure some folks will disagree with me, but I feel like. There are other franchises in your stable that need some franchise care. I mean, Metroid, we bring it up every other week. Hi, Metroid. Metroid. Remember, remember need, Metroid. We need Metroid Link. Where's, so. where's, the, uh, I need to like Don't hit the chisel, just like send it through. Um, yeah, exactly. Uh, so, yeah, we've, we've gone on with that one. 